Okay. Um, we won't start. <laughs> I don't think I'll start until I can figure out what to do. Okay. This is Morrowind. It's not going to just hand me the answer. I should speak with the soldiers here and see what I might learn from them. Do you have You're something to say, Dumner? Dumner? <gasps> uh, Dunmer. Guy got nothing to say. Sure could use a drink, though, and not that Nord swill. Okay. Let's see. What what does this statement tell tell me? <laughs> I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna work this through here. Um, he's got nothing to say. He does doesn't want to say anything. So the only thing he wants to say, he doesn't want. He's not gonna. He's not open to any other questions. Anything else? He could use a drink. They all could use a drink. And not the Nord's will. Maybe I've been... Hmm, have I been too fixated on th the latter part? On, like, the anti-Nord sentiment? No, because uh, that's uh, that's right. Because when when I was looking at like the religious aspect, I, I was focused on the drink bit. So he's got a problem. Is there a place to get a drink here? Like that can't be the problem, right? Yeah, that's what I thought. Like, why? Like, every everybody's actually wait. No, wait. The problem is low morale. Okay, I'm uh, okay. I'm gonna sell my my pelts. I, okay, I guess I'm starting now. <laughs> um, hi everyone. Welcome to my corner of the internet where I'm playing The Elder Scrolls Three Morrowind, uh, and I'm still lost. Um, I'll probably leave that first part in. Like, I'm I'm trying. I'm trying to figure out. Like the game's. I feel like it's given me hints. I feel like, um, I, I'm, I'm trying to work through this here. It, okay, it's telling me that they, they, the they don't have good, they don't have good relations with the Nords. It's telling me that th their morale is low, and they all could use a drink. So speak freely, friend. The pleasure is all mine. Is that because the religious people are like no to drinking? Okay, you don't even barter. Does anyone actually barter here? Yes. I want to, uh, maybe the armory actually would be a- oh, wait, wait, right. Marissa, can I get rid of my pelts? Yes, you will take my, uh, bristleback leather as well. I'm gonna keep the, uh, the niche leather because I can use the fortify intelligence, uh, to, uh, you know, exploit alchemy a little bit. Uh, wow, that is really not worth I guess whatever. I'll... What did I do to whatever. It's this it's it's some extra money. Um, should I go snooping around? Okay, I'm gonna. I, I think I'm gonna snoop around a little bit in the 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 uh, the, the imperial cult, and uh, I don't know. Maybe I'll get some something that ties into the alcohol. Wait a minute. It's under magic, right? Nord mead. Okay. Okay. Yeah, they don't want Nord mead. Cause I, I was like, I know, I know, I picked up some bottles of whatever crap, and I was like, well, if I had, if I had, if, if if I was supposed to give some to them, then that would have triggered, right? Uh, like they would have been like, oh, look, you have a thing, because it would have checked my inventory, and then. But it's Nord mead. Which is specifically what they don't want. I thought I had a bottle. Oh, I drank it, didn't I? I drank it straight off the body I took it from. Ah. I wonder, do I need to give them a drink? Is this like some really, what did like, I do to deserve this really, thing? like, obtuse, um, uh, like, fetch quest? Okay, let's, let's, let's see. It, um... Darn it. Wait, they should be scattered all over the place, right? I left them on the ground. Well, those there was potions too though, right? 
Okay, I'm gonna run back out to all those things I left on the ground. Yeah, but it's probably like some Nord meat or something, right? No, no, it's not. There was uh, there was bottles. I think there was. I may have drank them already though. There was grief. I seem to recall there being like. These guys just keep coming back. They just keep respawning. Holy crap! Um. All right. Some here's some bodies. That's a potion of oh. Mazda. Okay, let's see. Let's see if this counts. I'm gonna run back. I'm gonna actually. I'm actually gonna be mad if that turns out to be the solution. Cause I'm like that. That's so not. It's like it's it's obvious if you st actually stop and take like time to be sort of work through it. Um. I don't know why I felt the need to stop and listen to that. Um, I guess I'll just walk up to a guard. Uh, you. What do you? Hey, is that booze I smell on you? Okay, this was simultaneously. This was simultaneously obvious, and um, not obvious. I'm just I'm just hitting stuff on my desk now. I'm just like ah. Oh, I'm frustrated. It, I, I'm frustrated, but I, I love it. It's like, I love it when games uh, do that. Uh, it's, I, 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 cause I feel respected, right? I feel like the game has respected me to take my time and actually like work things out and figure it out. And even though I'm frustrated, I'm grateful. It's like this, it's like this, 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 this conflicting, this is such a conflicted emotion. Yes, it is booze you smell on me. It smells like Mazda to me. I know the smell anywhere. How about giving me a thirsty soldier a little pick-me-up? Sure, take it. Mazda, good stuff. Thanks, friend. Just hasn't been the same around here since this became a dry fort. It's ridiculous, I tell you. Okay, here we go. Break. Okay, dry fort. Tell me about this dry fort. That's right, no liquor at all is allowed at Fort Frostmoth these days. Captain's or Captain's orders! <laughs> I, uh, I put in, um... I put in rules to drop morale. I'm wondering why the morale's going down. Hmm. I mean, I'm, I'm not a drinker myself, like, it, it doesn't improve my mood at all. I, I, actually, I actually have a very strict rule that if I'm in... Like, I'm not opposed to drinking, I generally don't. Every once in a while, but I have a strict rule. If, if I'm in a, a bad mood, I will not drink, because... To, I, it's, to me, it's... I don't want it to be a crutch or anything. I don't even want to tempt that. Like, no, it's not a coping thing for me. Um, I don't know. So, sorry, that's not relevant. Let's let's get back to let's back to the game. Sorry, um, Captain's orders. I guess seemed odd coming from him. Captain uh, Carrier seemed like a fair enough guy as long as we carried out our duties. Guess he figured we weren't up to his standards, so he cut us off. Since then, everyone's been in, in a pretty foul mood. Not a very observant captain either, right? Like, uh, you think. You think like I I did this action. All of a sudden, this this is this is happening. It's like it's a simple uh, case of um, cause and effect, right? This cause has uh, has you know it has caused this effect. Hmm. All right. Um. Interesting. It's Captain Carius, tell me about him. I thought he was a pretty good guy until this whole alcohol ban. Just seems kind of spiteful to me. Fort Frostmoth. Tell me about the place. You're in Fort Frostmoth, jewel of the Empire. Get out while you can. <laughs> I like that. Um. Okay, so now, will Let's all the guards- Let's aside our rivalries and talk, shall we? Sure. Uh, will all the guards talk to me now? What is it you want? I heard you might be able to get hold of some booze. Yeah, I love it. And you don't seem to have any more that I need to even drink. I hate this place. Okay, so now the guards will talk to us, because we've gotten the reputation as like... <laughs> we're their supplier. <laughs> ah, there we go. There's, there's the natural through line. Alexis, potion junkie to boo smuggler. Yep, that, that, that sounds about right. Okay, let's, uh... Okay, let's, let's actually, um, look at the journal, see if we get any more tips. Let's read things carefully from now on. A soldier has agreed to speak with me in exchange for some liquor I had with me. Apparently, Captain Carius has forbidden all alcohol consum consumption, and the soldiers are restless. They believe he has done it as a punishment for poor performance. I should report my findings to Carius. Cool, I don't remember where Carius is. I can't remember if it was the armory or the general quarters. 
I want to say it's the general quarters, which is why I'm going up the armory. Supply room. I'm listening. Ooh, there's a supply room. Yes. Wait, what's it? Okay, just bottles. Yeah, but what? What? what okay, what? Like, what was? What was in these bottles? I'm like, is the captain just like hoarding it all for himself? Okay, these are all just ingredients. I was, I was kind of curious to see if like, ah, oh, is he, uh, is he, is he keeping a stash? Is, is that what it is? He's like, ah, is, is he one of those yes, people who's just gonna moving. like keep everything for himself? Uh, actually, something like that I would assume would be under lock and key. Uh, this guy is really close. Can I pull off uh, searching this while he's staring right at me? Okay, I, I gotta try. I gotta try. Haha. Uh, okay. Alright. Yeah, yeah, that's right. Good, 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 good. He moved. He moved. Just what I needed him to do. Okay. Uh, lockpick. Nothing in there. Okay, never mind. I'm leaving. Alright, anyway, supply room. Carious chambers. There we go. I asked you to investigate why the morale has been low in the fort. Have you learned anything? Uh, yeah, give me a second. <clears throat> He's like, uh, okay. I'm like, I want to go into your room. I want to see if you've got any of the goods, like, stashed away in your room. Yeah. I'll help myself to a few gold. My troubles. Uh, that's leather. I, like, I could take it. Okay. Oh, wait! Oh, that's a potion. Grief! He's got grief and Flynn! <gasps> Come on. Turn it, small chest. Come on! Yeah, there we go. Alright, so you do have some, but I, I don't know if I'd say... An, of life's little disappointments. I'm not sure I'd say he's got enough... It's, there's not enough to prove that he's just, like, storing and stashing it all for himself. Like, he's got a few bottles, which, you know, could have been there from before the thing. He's punishing them, not himself. Either way, whatever, let's talk. I asked you to investigate the while the morale has been low in the fort. Have you learned anything? As a matter of fact, I have. Hmm. I imagine that the lack of alcohol might have some effects on the morale, but I didn't ever actually ban it. Personally, I didn't even care about the alcohol. It was the priest, Antonius uh, Nuncius, who was worried about the effect it was having on the men. I disagreed, but the question became moot. Our shipments stopped coming in months ago. Speak with the soldiers a bit more and see if you can find out who the source of this discontent is. Okay... So they think it was him, but he's saying it was the priest. Now, we, we suspected the priest before, didn't we? Because he, 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 he made a point. Like, him and, um, was it Marissa? They, they're, they're very anti-alcohol. And who puts, it in the, who puts in the orders for the supplies? Like, that would be the captain guy, wouldn't it? All right, let's, uh, let's have a chat. Do you have something to say, Dumner? Yes, Dumner. Um, okay, what, what can you tell me more about this dry fort thing? I'd feel a whole lot better talking about this if I had some booze to wet my whistle. I heard you might have some more on you, but I guess you don't. That's a shame. Okay, I already gave some to you. Maybe you'll talk to me. Uh, look, I'm not sure what caused all this. I just know that I heard from Antonius Nuncius that the captain had placed a ban on all alcohol, all, all alcohol at the fort. And sure enough, there was none to be found. All right. He, okay, she heard from the priest guy. The priest. He's not bad, I guess, for a priest. You'll find him at the Imperial Cult Shrine here at the fort. Though he keeps an office upstairs from the armory. Could be in either place. Seems to understand us soldiers pretty well. He was telling me just the other day how it seemed unfair that the captain had cut us off from the drink. He figures that's one of our few pleasures on this dung heap of an island. All right. The priest keeps an office upstairs from the armory. Now, part of me wants to talk. 
My pleasure, really. Part of me wants to just go ahead and confront him directly, but I want to go to the armory. I want to find this dude, this dude's office, and I want to see if he is taking the stuff for himself. Yes, Dunmer. Um. Okay. Who, who, how do I know who's? Okay, I need to know whose place I'm in. Huh. I don't think the priest would have a um. A battle axe in his uh, in his chest. All right, so these both have. I'm just gonna close this. Would this be the the? Uh... No, this wouldn't be the priest's room, right? Oh wait, Antonius Nuncius's closet. This is his place. Darn it! We're finally we're finally working through our many lockpicks. I want to see what's in your closet. Lockpick success. All the strange lock appears to have been disabled. This closet cannot open without the key. Shall we go pickpocket him? <laughs> we're, 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 gonna, we're solving this like a thief. Like a night blade. Yes. All right. Uh, I want, I want, uh, I want in there. I want to see that in there. Uh, all right. Saving. Just in case I get caught, because this is going to suck if I get caught. Um. You know what? I don't want to risk it with just, like, the, 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 the John Cena thing. No, I want. I'm going to let my. I I'm breaking up my, my good spells. I want to. I want to be buffed up really well. All right. So I've got a whole lot of chameleon. Um. Now, uh, I think security is for pickpocketing, right? No, security is. All right. So sneak is also good at pickpocket. All right. So I was able to, and that is uh, agility is the primary. Um, all right. Uh, wait, that's, this is not the guy. It's this guy. Oh, I had the wrong target. No. <gasps> Look what he's got on him. All right, I'm not taking it. We're going to just confront him. Oh, wait, no. I wanted to see if there was a key in there. Alright, no key. Alright, hi! What can I do for you? I'd like to talk about this dry fort business. Yes, odd that the captain would ban liquor for his troops. There's no understanding some people. Well, he tells me he never banned alcohol. Told you that, did he? I guess he never officially did. Still, the shipment stopped arriving. What's to be done about that? Did they stop arriving? Well, I have no idea why. I am but a simple priest, forced to serve these pathetic soldiers on this terrible frozen excuse for an island. It's not my concern why the alcohol hasn't arrived. You have no proof I've done anything wrong. Stop asking me these questions! Dude, not gonna lie, it's a little suspicious. I mean, you got two bottles with you. Where did you get them, buddy? I mean, it's, it's, not, it's not a smoking gun, but... I'm going back to your uh, your office. I got fixated on that big thing. I mean, it's possible that there was something else I missed. Like, why else would he have? Like, why is that? Why else is that cabinet all like enchanted and locked up? Is the I'm like, is there anything written on this paper? Uh, Verity's Faith. Look, he's got bottles here! Okay, is it in your desk? Look, he's got bottles in there, too! <gasps> and is that- He's even got skooma! You know what? It, it, to me, it, it seems a little strange that this book is just sitting in the middle of the floor. Hold on. 
Okay, I, I just needed to see if it was un like if there was something under the book. All right, nothing under the book. I just needed to check under the books. I, I love that there was two copies of um, varieties of faith, like literally stacked in a way that they were like going through each other. Now it's going through the desk. Whatever. Uh, hmm. Nothing on top. Where does he get? Where is he keeping that key? All right. Um. Speak freely, friend. Hmm. You're a guard that works in this area. Maybe you could tell me something about him. Don't mind me, I'm just gonna go ahead and grab this grief. All right. Hey, buddy, how's Keep it going? Moving. Um, what is it you want? I heard you might be able to get a hold of some booze. Yeah, here you go. I heard you might have some grief on you. Could sure use a bit. Here, take it. I got it just for you, buddy. <laughs> a bit of grief does me good. I won't forget this. You've been asking uh, around why this is a dry fort, right? Yeah. Look, I'm not sure what caused all this. I just know that I heard from Antonius Nuncius that the captain has placed a ban on all blah, blah, blah. Yeah, but he, he didn't. Uh, what can you tell me about the, st uh, the, the, um, shipments? You can't tell me anything about the shipments. Hmm. What can you tell me about the priest? I've got nothing more to say about him. Go talk to him if you want. Or wait for him in his office. It's upstairs. Yeah, it's right here. Is this his office? No, this is, would be... That's his office. Maybe this is where he sleeps. I don't know. Nothing up on top there. All right, so the key is not obtainable from him. Um, shipments. Let's go down to the dock. Basks in the sun might be able to tell us. You know, he, um, he's 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 right here by where all the shipments are. Maybe he's got some insight into uh, you know where these shipments are going. If it, if anything's being un unloaded in a certain way. He's a pair of boots. How hard could it be? I know Basques, man. I know Basques. Uh, do you wish to go back to Vardenfell as much as I do? No. What about Ravenrock, where the new colony is going to be built? I could take you there for a price. Interesting. The colony grows. With any luck, it will bring more travelers. I'm actually m more curious about... Um, no, you don't know anything about that. I figured, you know, shipments coming in off the boat. You know, he's always right by here. Maybe he would have some info on that. But it doesn't look like that's the case. Um, I'm listening. I guess I could go back and talk to the captain. All right, captain. I asked you to investigate why yeah, the yeah, morale yeah. has been low. In um, the have you learned anything? If there's, if there's reason to suspect Antonius Nuncius, find the proof. If you feel that you have it, confront the man himself. Then report to me. Let's do this right, Alexis. All right. I do suspect him. Uh, and I've been looking for evidence. Wait. Shipment stopped. Uh, maybe you can tell me... Um, who does the ordering? I asked you to investigate why yeah, yeah. the morale yeah, yeah, yeah. has been low. In the if you believe he's connected with this low morale here at the fort, find some proof. If you think you have proof, confront him. Let's see how he reacts to it. Okay, so yeah, this is basically saying uh, we need to... Keep wait. Moving. What if... What if we... <laughs> one of those bottles... That we gave to the guard. What if we get another yes. bottle and show him the bottle? So if we grab like this Flynn and we're like, hey, hey, look, look what I found here, and he'll be like, <gasps> a pleasure to meet. Yes. I mean, with with any luck, he'll just accuse us of stealing, and then he'll attack us, and then we'll like just kill him and be like, oh, that problem sorted itself out. Hi. I have your Flynn. Yes. What is can this humble What do you want? You? Um, ship and stop arriving. Well, I have no idea. You've been in my desk? My desk? You've been in there? Oh yeah, we have. Wait, that's an outrage! Stolen liquor? I have no idea. All right, perhaps I have been hiding the alcohol. It was for their own good, and I had hoped that if the soldiers got fed up and revolted, I'd be able to justify going home to my superiors. Look, I don't want any trouble from you. I'll need to report this to Carius. 
I'm not a fan of liars. I'm finished. I'll never leave this island now. At least not alive. Karis will have my head. What have you done? I hope you're happy, Alexis. As a matter of fact, I am. Yes. Alexis the Honest Thief! <laughs> yes, there we go. That's, 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 that's the title I'm going with. Hi, how's it going? I asked you to investigate why the Dude, get, get some new lines. The fort. Have you learned anything? You say that Antonius Nunzius started this whole thing because he wanted to go home? The twit! I could have had him reassigned had he just asked me. See? Honesty, man. Now, though, I think he might do his best work here, saving the souls of my men. With the new abundance of liquor at the fort, someone will have to deliver their salvation. Thank you for your help, Alexis. Take these. There are diseases on this island that we have never encountered before. And the weapon may serve you well. Now, on to more for business. Okay, Silver Spark Blade. Three potion of cure common disease. <laughs> See, that, 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 like, um... It's, it, it's funny because of how difficult the island is geared for. And the fact that you basically become immune to disease. But it's not unheard of for someone to, you know play the game all out of order, so they still kind of have to treat you like if you're a, um, a low-level character, which I, 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 I like. It, it, it's, it's, it's like, it's useless to me, but things like this make it so that Morrowind can be played in all sorts of different orders. Um, I'm not sure I'll need that silver spark blade. Wait a minute, silver spark blade. I'm like, wait a minute, isn't Blood Moon, like, I don't know anything about it, but I know that it involves werewolves, right? I don't the, the, here have a silver blade. Okay, let's let's hear some more for business. What what kind of uh, wait? Really? Your disposition with me is only fifty-two. All right, for business. As I've told you, not all of my soldiers are here are trustworthy. Many were sent to this fort in lieu of Ebenhart's dungeons. Now I fear that a criminal element has shown itself at Fort Frostmoth. I believe that there are. Weapons being smuggled out of here and sold on Vardenfell. Oh, do, do, do tell me more. Weapons being smuggled out of here? I've noticed the store of weapons in the armory has been decreasing, and I know there is no official reason for it. My only guess is that someone is smuggling them off Soulsteam to be sold on Vardenfell. I want you to uncover the smuggling ring, and I will provide you with a bit of help. Tell me about the smuggling. It is a dangerous thing here at Fort Frostmoth. Our supplies are limited, and without them, I fear the soldiers will grow even more restless. And what is a fort without its weapons? Useless! What's the bit of help? I would like you to work with one of my soldiers on this case. There are two available to you, and they are two of the best here at Fro Fort Frostmoth. Uh, Sanus uh, Lysius and Gaia Artoria? You'll find Lysius in the general quarters and Artoria in the general quarters. So they're both in the general quarters. Okay. Upper level. Sorry, sorry. Speak with them and decide which will be your companion. When you have unearthed the smuggling ring, report to me. I leave how you deal with the smugglers to your discretion. Cool. I kind of like this this investigation type um, setup. All right. So, uh, what can you tell me about them, though? Uh, Lysias knows more about the daily activities here at the fort than any other soldier in my command. While not our strongest fighter, he is he more than makes up for it with his savvy. He may be the best suited to ferret out the smuggling ring. And Gaia uh, Artoria, she is one of the, uh, my most loyal soldiers, and one of my most powerful. I have never seen her bested in combat, and her skill with weapons is legendary here at the fort. Should you encounter any resistance with these smugglers, Artoria would be a valuable ally to have. <sighs> so, investigation-wise, it sounds like Lucius would be the better pick, but if things go, depending on how big the ring is... I'm like, uh, the, the muscle would be good, but... Like, we're doing an investigation. Well, I want information. I'm pretty confident with my own ability. Hmm. Well, you know what? I'm gonna have time to think about it because I'm out of time for today, so... We're gonna end things here. Uh, if you liked the video, give it a thumbs up. If you did not, leave it a thumbs down. Either way, let me know what you thought in the comment section. Next time, we're gonna pick our partner for this buddy cop <laughs> movie. And, uh... Yeah, it's it's it's, it's going to be great. Hopefully, maybe. I'm I'm not that confident it's going to be great, but it might be. It might be great. It might be okay or mediocre. 
But until that mediocre choice and time and stuff and things, I'd like to ask you all to game on.